Jack uh, inhibitors as a, uh, is a good option for these patients so when they respawn and they have uh, smaller spleen size. They have better transplant outcomes. They have fewer graft failures. They have fewer poor graft function afterwards. Uh, so I think uh, in, uh, for example, our center, all of the patients receive pre-treatment with uh, JAK inhibitors, and uh, we even have a protocol when they receive JAK inhibitors before the transplant, and uh, as graft versus host disease prophylaxis uh, uh, after the transplant, actually, there is a trial, phase three trial commencing in uh, Russia in September when we'll uh, evaluate this approach in acute leukemia. So when we use post-transplant cyclophosphamide and JAK inhibitor as a prophylaxis with no additional GVHD prophylaxis.